too cute. Um, splat vests are rigged. Yeah, sure, okay. They were rigged in the first game, too. It's fine. Uh, I wish squids were real. But anyway, this is my Octoling so far. Uh, I don't have a... Uh, I don't have a proper design for this young lady quite yet. Um, we're going to look at my gear. And we're going to actually... Uh, you know, we're going to finish grinding out on these... Uh, on these this specific gear set and then we're going to um and then we're going to actually pick like a canonical design for this young lady i'd say uh we'll go into a regular battle i'm nzap trash fair warning i only use nzap and also a roller because i was roller trash in the first game so Oh, nice! We got the best map, Kelp Dome. Uh, I don't play ranked uh, because I don't have my ranked gear done with yet. Um, all I've got left for my ranked gear is a t-shirt that I'm tinkering with. And it's only a few chunks away at this point, so... That's uh, something to keep in mind. But, uh... We got Octo. I'm very tempted to, like, include the... Uh, um, gold hairpin as part of the canonical design for this. Like, let's be real. It was really hard, and we got a roller. Hey, what's up? Oh, good fling, I guess. Why did that not kill me in one fling, though? Uh, we're not gonna let that roller live his life, unfortunately. I'm sorry, buddy, but you kinda can't do that to me. There's someone behind me. There they are. All right, Splushomatic with uh, Tenacity, Special Power Up, and Main Saver. All right, that's a pretty good kit. Uh, do feel free to request my friendship on Switch. I've got no qualms about adding anybody and everybody uh, because I like playing with pals. Uh, oh, heck, the Octoling uh, sounds are different, aren't they? You think you can splat me from here, you buffoon? I know the roller's range perfectly. I was a roller main for three years. Oh. <laughs> That's what I get. The golden toothpick fit, fits perfectly in the, like, updo? Okay. Uh, I might actually change the updo then. I don't know. I'll see how it looks with this first, though. Because I really like this, like, the swoopty swoo going on here i dig it we're gonna play poorly and uh ink the other team's base and then we're not gonna play poorly i lied oh all i needed was enough to do this oh come on the flings a roller is a completely different set of kit that I'm used to. Uh, I'm used to playing against Sploon 1 rollers, I guess. Like, I did run roller, like, 99.9% .9 of the time in Sploon 1. Um, the other, like, 0.1% of the time was a slosher because the, uh, because of the, because my, uh, brrr, because the stage composition or the matches that we're currently running in ranked uh, wouldn't wasn't exactly the most tenable for a roller. Ooh, and especially like late late game Sploon one, uh, the roller was not exactly favored by the meta. So I kind of picked up the slosher. I picked up the slosher control for. I picked up the slosher for control. Yes, no. I picked up the slosher for tower control. Uh, just because playing a roller on tower control, you have to have you know incredibly precise control over your flings. And it was something that I struggled with, so I just ran Slosher for ranked. Oh, wow, we got melted. It was a good match, though. Oh, dang it, that tweet failed to send. Let me try it again. Because I found that actually tweeting that you're streaming uh, helps. So right now, we're running the uh, headphones you can get in real life. 
the null armor replica and the arrow polons. I'm tempted to make the arrow polons part of the cannon gear for this young lady. Uh, just for this for this fact that it will actually get me to super jump more than once. Oh dang it! Can I? Can I get pick my friend request from here? We'll find out. Friend quests. We'll find out if I can do this, if this is allowed. I don't know who this is, but welcome, <laughs> Bo Rock. Come, friends. Okay. Spoon. Oh, communication error. I can't, in fact, do that. <laughs> uh, but uh, feel free to just uh, hop over to the friends mode and join me. Uh, if there's ever more than eight of you, uh, we'll sort it out from there. I might just do uh, private battles if there's more than eight of you. But it's me, Borok. Okay, cool, Art Shadow. I'm glad to see you. Now I got you on here, so you can join me at any given time. It doesn't have to be on stream. You can just hop in. I'm a f like 500% down on it. <laughs> we got a team of four Octolings. Uh, looks like two dualies, a Clash Blaster, and an Enzap, which is going to be interesting. Ah, I, took, I deserve that splat. The hero dualies, though. More power to you. 10,000% is hard. 10,000%, well, I shouldn't say 10,000% hard, it's just grueling. You know, like, hard was the Octo expansion. Like, hard Splatoon is the Octo expansion. Grueling Splatoon is 10,000%. Uh, it's a lot of doing the same thing over and over and over again with very little variance. <laughs> Well, this person knows their way around a blaster. Points to you, dude. Ah, ha, ha. You're gonna have to wait. It's already full. Yeah, the room should clear up uh, pretty much immediately following this match. So keep that in mind. If you've already like, uh, if you already hit wait, if you already like picked me, um, it should uh, shunt you into a uh, waiting queue. I'm gonna do some stream hops. Uh, I may be back, but if not, good night. All right, all right, lullaby. Uh, I was glad to see you. Uh, I hope you enjoyed me absolutely flipping out uh, when I got that, when I got the golden toothpick. Yeah, the regular campaign with all the weapons is a pain. It's not difficult, it's just a pain. <laughs> I did it uh, when I was at college where the internet did not allow me to play. Wow, I really wish I had something with thermal ink because then I could have dunked on that dualies, you know? Um... But also thermal ink doesn't work very well sometimes. It's supposed to, it really only shows you a player through a wall, uh, which is unfortunate. Like if it let you see a player, um, oh, how did that person not splat me like six times? Oh man, the octo shot. Oh, we're we're switching to the octo shot next time we change our gear. Like I know I love the I love the end zap and it's my best it's it's best boy. Um but <laughs> we gotta try this octo shot i haven't given a shot i haven't played it yet uh and it looks like it's a pretty sensible set of kit you know so we're gonna give the octo shot a shot when we change gear i love the little like vimo uh that um octolings put out it's a cute noise i, I just love the like little all the player character noises are adorable and they're they're wonderful and like Wow, I have not been super jumping this entire match, despite having drop roller, which makes super jumping, like, 100% safer. I just spent how long hitting people who have ink jets, so I think I all... Oh, I've been more or less just sticking with a hero shot replica. That's fair, man. It's a perfectly good splatter shot, you know? I don't know, I'm gonna... I'm gonna run the uh, octo shot for a little bit once we uh, get enough to change our headgear around, which shouldn't be too long from now. Especially if we keep winning matches like this. Oh, I love the Octoling animations. They're adorable. Ten splats? What is this? I never get any splat. That wasn't me. That was two splats. I, I can read. 
All right, we got main saver. I think I'm gonna go for a pure on the uh, on the null armor, because you know, uh, just pures are really nice to have. You can just toss them into any gear set, and I like the way the null armor looks. I don't know. I might try and find some feats that uh, go well with the Art Shadow Nine Nine Six is now following. Welcome to the Igloo. Thank you so much for sticking around. Uh, what was I saying before? Anyway, welcome to the Igloo. Uh, glad to see you. Uh, Wednesdays is usually stuff like this. We're playing whatever game I want to pull out of the pile. Uh, Friday nights is uh, something called Paper Cuts, which is uh, I read a public domain book. Uh, at least half of a public domain book every, every Friday night. Uh, if you need something to just have in your ears or if you have a book that you've been needing to read for your literature class that's you know vexing you and you would like somebody else to read it for you so send me an email at glacier gmail.com um because you know anything made before 1923 is fair game so if you if you have a if you have a book that you don't want to read for class or you just want to hear me read uh feel free to email me about that um I suppose, like, you could just whisper me on Twitch as well, but email's a little easier. I check it more often. Um, oh, shoot, I don't have um, point sensors. Not point sensors, uh, jump beacons. I really wish that jump beacons were an option on an NZAP-like weapon. I cannot believe I splatted that person. We got a bomb launcher somewhere. Sounds like... Uh, sounds like just ordinary splat bomb launcher. Oh, that charger's gonna kill me. Oh, or maybe not, but the duelies will kill me. Low. Uh, derp a derp with the hero duelies. Uh, seen a lot of this one. I don't know, I'm thinking I'm gonna try and, I'm gonna see what the, uh, golden toothpick looks like. Uh, probably run that, and if I, and just find a set of, like, I think there's a set of, like, combat boot looking things. Which would go really well with the null armor. What was that splat and why did I get it? What is this? I never get splats. And here I am just like melting people. Ah, oh, my armor has died. That did not in fact extend the duration of the armor like I was hoping it would. <laughs> I should have waited like if I'd have waited like two or three frames we'd probably just now be running out of armor oh I didn't I, I thought that was a player <laughs> oh that's a fair splat we got peachy with the clash blaster neo what's the clash blaster neo's special I, I'm an idiot watching that person on my kill cam use the ten missiles what's the special on that one I'm a dummy <laughs> uh, Ooh, this is gonna take. This is gonna be a really interesting uh, push if this team comes back. Uh, you know. Oh, I don't have my. Oh, I was hoping to have my armor. Uh oh, that's gonna kill me. Maybe not. How did that not kill me? Oh, I was expecting to get the assist on that uh, on Killy Kid there, but GG. Good, good, good play. Uh, let's super jump, because I got drop roller, boys. Haha, -ha, drop roller, take that! <laughs> Use drop roller one time. <laughs> Best player. <laughs> I clearly take the most advantage of my gear. Oh, what is this? What was that splat? Wow! This is crazy. I think this actually, like... Spending so much time on the Agent 3 fight has actually improved my play a little bit. That or I just had a really good team. It looks like I had a really good team. We got Vimo, we got me, we got uh, Art Shadow, and we got we got uh, That Nerd. All great use. Oh, now I feel bad about boasting. They had a DC. That's, that's why we were doing so well. They were short a person. But I'm thinking, I'm, I really like the way the null armor looks. I'm, I'm probably going to try and find um, find some feats for this young lady. Uh, I think I have some snow boots, actually, that would look really cute. 
Uh, and then we'll see how the... Uh... Are just none of my tweets sending? Oh no, but the if this, the if this then that tweet has finally sent. Uh, <clears throat> I don't know. We'll see how the uh, the gold hairpin looks. If not, I might just run the um, the null suit helmet. Looks cool. I don't know what the uh, ability on it is though. Is the problem? Uh, I don't know. We'll we'll cross that. We'll cross the gear bridge when we're a little closer to it. Um, for now, I just I just want to talk about this game. I like this game a lot, and I was really. I was a big old salty boy when I found out I couldn't uh, do this at school. I honestly don't think I'm good with the inkjet, so I don't use it. I'm also not a super jumper because I don't want to take any chances getting splatted. That's part of why I have like four or five pieces of drop roller gear that I then proceed to never use anyway, because <laughs> I don't like uh, I don't like super jumping. Because it was even worse in the first game because there was, well, it was actually a little better in the first game because stealth jump was. Uh, it functioned a little differently. Oh, ho, ho. somebody clip that one. Somebody clip that. I'm saving the clip on, like, on file here. Somebody clip that. That was beautiful. Like, two splats in a row, one of them being a super jump. I'm, uh, I'm, uh, I'm gonna submit that to a, uh, highlight reel channel I know about. Because that was a good, that was a good, that was a good set of splats. Sure, it was only two out of four, but it was good splats, you know? Good splats are good splats. I don't know, this game, uh, Splatoon in general is, like, really, like, I'm very fond of it. I wouldn't say it's near and dear to me yet. Uh, it's, it's not been out long enough to be near and dear to me, but I am very fond of it. And, uh, it was my last, uh, it was my last big game that I, you know, lived in, uh, before college. And, uh, like, the... The period between me going to college and me uh, graduating high school was essentially like 99% uh, me playing the first Splatoon. Uh, it was, I was really into it, you know. I was, uh, I was, you know, putting in enough time that I could have been playing professionally, honestly. And like, had I been a little more into Twitch at that point, I probably would have been streaming quite a bit of it. Oh, what? What are we are we gonna get are we gonna get three out of this? Are we gonna get three out of this? We gonna get three out of this. Nope, two. Cool. Na 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 One of you needs to stay alive, thank you. Oh, I timed that I timed that roll really well. No you don't, Mr. Dooleys. You and your you kids in your drop you kids in your rolls your dualies he said as though he doesn't like want to play dualies pretty forcefully and just doesn't play because drop roll is something that i would absolutely not take advantage of uh oh also like this undercover brella is something that i'd love to get into my toolkit it's it's a really fun like it's kind of the antithesis of the normal brella you can just kind of leave it open and just bam 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 GG's on both sides. We got we got good numbers tonight, up above a thousand most of the time. There we go. Now we can change into the uh, the hairpin and see how it looks. Ooh, I don't like the abilities that I'm getting out of the out of the real life headphones because by the way, you can buy those uh, hook cans in real life. I'm thinking maybe like the Octoling shades and the null suit shirt and a set of boots that I think that look fresh, you know? Oh, we're gonna switch to the Octo shot while I'm thinking about it. Ooh, or we could go with this uh, mountain coat. That's cute. Oh man, that's cute. Dang it. Or the NW or the Splatoon World Championship tee or the Zeko Jade coat maybe. I don't know. There's just so much good stuff. We'll like take a we'll take a real close look at gear once I've uh, maxed out the other two pieces that I'm wearing. We got Kelp Dome, the best map. We got a we got a slosher, everybody. Slosher alert. 
We got two two splatter shots, a slosher, and was that a dualies? I don't know. I wasn't paying close enough attention. I love the music in this game, by the way. I don't know if the game sounds a little too low to pick it out, but I love the music in this game. Oh no, it's Inkjet. I'm not a fan of this. That's kind of sounded like she said booyah. That's cute. All right, what do you think? Uh, we're gonna go this way. Ooh, yes, that was a good roll. It was a good choice. Good choice of roll. I like this. Uh, aren't these like the uh, the official cannon colors for uh, for Splune Two? They're good colors. I'm. I don't know. I want to run the Octo Shot because it's a, it's a cool gun, but I don't know how I feel about it. Uh, we'll play a couple matches and see how it feel. See how it feels. You know, you really gotta get a handle on a on a gun like this. It's got a it's got a good enough fire rate for me. You know, I'm all about them really high fire rate splatter shots that don't uh, necessarily do a lot of damage per shot, but they're really just brrr, that's just kind of my vibe. Wow, we're really putting the pressure on this dude. Oh, nice, nice auto bomb throw. That was really well timed. Oh, nice trade. Everybody playing fresh today. Uh oh. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> Take that. Heads up. Oh, that was ours. Okay. Whew, I thought that wasn't mine and I was worried. Thought I died for a second there. If we uh, if we want to play this game, this is a game I can play, my guy. Oh, I'm getting rained on. That's a problem. Oh, I had the worst time to run out of ink. Oh, those glasses. Those glasses are kind of cool. Yeah, I'm headed that way. What do you think I was jumping over here for, man? I'm heading that way. Alright, we got that guy. You guys got the cleanup over here, right? No? God. It drives me nuts when a slosher doesn't play cleanup. Because, like, as when I played slosher, uh, it was very much the cleanup class for me. What do we got? We got 11 seconds left. I'm gonna get splatted. Yep. Oh, unsportsmanlike conduct. I'm sorry. I have a very, I have a very low tolerance for squid bagging, i.e. zero tolerance. Like the only time I'll, I'll, you know, like, yeah, and like get into it is when we're doing salmon run. Actually, salmon run would be a good thing to do on stream. And eh, 922 is respectable numbers. But yeah, I don't know. I don't know about the arrow pull ones. Uh, they just—they've been kind of my uh, <clears throat> my default grinding feet uh, so far. And I don't know how I feel about it because uh, I think they're uh, Tony Kensa, and they don't give me the right chunks. I need to find a pair of like cute boots that have the uh, have the right brand on them to get me the chunks I want and the chunks I'll use. <laughs> Like swim speed and uh, special charge, special saber is what I'm looking for right now. I'm looking to get a, uh, I think the shirt I have in mind for my inkling is a special saber. It's going to wind up being a special saber pure, which is going to be a lot of work. Also, uh, Art Shadow, you used the vending machine, right? Because you've already beaten Agent 3. I don't want to spoil what the vending machine gives you. <laughs> and heck, like, I don't know that you can even see the vending machine in the game until you've beaten it, so... It's not really a spoiler, but it is a spoiler, because, like, you get some pretty fresh stuff out of that out of that vending machine. I'm gonna be real. It's some, it's some pretty fresh deals. Oh, oh, I was... I thought that was auto-bomb launcher, and I was gonna get salty. Oh, mm. I had that coming. You have beaten 
So you know what comes out of the vending machine. Yeah, I need to use that after this drink wears off. I'm gonna use. I'm gonna use some of those because uh, the drinks actually overrule. Uh, the drinks probabilities overrule uh, branding. Um, even if the brand actually works in your favor for that thing, which is you know nice if you uh, are not one to care about. Oh, see, I'm used to having ink armor where I can just bap it and call it good. Try slosher. That's a good. That's a good kit. Uh, thankfully, I finished all my homework from my job at work today. Uh, I shouldn't say homework because it's not necessarily inherently homework. Because he, because the trainer leaves like an hour before we technically should. So like, functionally, it's not homework. It's just an assignment. See, the issue with me playing here, or with me playing Octoshot, is then I need to remember that I don't have ink armor. Oh, come on! Ah! Oh. Neo Splash Matic, alright. I'm a fan of that kid. Like, if you couldn't tell, I'm a very much a fan of just high output kits. Very fast, very, uh, you know, somewhat. You know, I would say a uh, high uh, high output medium spread is kind of my vibe. You know, kind of the NZAP and the uh, like the NZAP and the splooshes and uh, like the I guess kind of the hero shot is is it that high fire rate when you get the replica? I can't remember. I don't know. Like I'm I'm big on high coverage. Look, I'm I'm big on like high coverage middling damage when it comes to splatter shots. Wow, I was really going for trying to climb that and it just didn't it didn't happen um stop trying to make fetch happen oh cool uh the octo shot has splat bombs didn't know that was part of it no communication error McCree return well, since we got kicked out, uh, let's go through our gear. See if we can find any feetsies that suit this set. Uh, where's my gear? Equip. See if we got any feetsies on hand that will suit this young lady. Uh, I'll come back to the drop rollers, I promise. I don't know, the ghillie boots, actually. The issue with the ghillie boots is they have, um, they have object shredder, and I don't know that I'm big on that. I don't know, the Null Boots obviously fit, and they have Drop Roller. Uh, those don't fit at all. Uh, the School Shoes don't really fit. The Noromakis are for another gear set for my Inkling. Um, the Punk Blacks actually fit really well. I don't know, this is kind of a fresh look. Oh, you still won? Nice! I'm glad to hear that. Uh, what are these boots? These are the Octoling boots. Those do fit, but they also have Object Shredder. I really wish I could get a different main on those. These are my Inklings feet, my uh, Noromakis. Uh, they got Special Charge Up, and uh, then they got Ink Saber, Ink Recovery, and Ink Resistance. I uh, got a hat with the same subs and, well, the same arrangement of items in a different sub slash main order. I don't know, the, the Punk Blacks have... Uh, special saver which would go really well with the hairpin and the and the uh the jacket i have on right now i don't know man um the imperials maybe Ooh, the cherries the cherries look good the issue is they have stealth jump which is like not really my vibe i don't know why i bought them probably because they just, i just thought they look fresh uh the angry rain boots not really um I don't know. Let's go with the uh, let's go with the punk blacks. They have a good ability on them. Um. So then we got the punk blacks, the no armor replica. I don't know. Let's go through my shirts because I got a billion shirts. We got the octoling armor, the no armor replica, um, an octo t. That's cute. Um. We got the chili mountain coat. Has swim speed up. That would be fun. Um. We got the uh, Splatoon World Championships t. Which is cute and has swim speed up. We got uh we got cold blooded on this wind crusher. I got something in mind for this wind crusher though. I got I got something in mind for a couple of these windbreakers actually. Um uh the caps uh Captain Cuttlefish's 
uh, sweatshirt clothing thing. Uh, this is actually, I think, the shirt I had in mind for my actual kit. It's not done yet. It's either the red hula punk with the tie and like the watch thing, or the uh, Aloha shirt for my actual kit, for my Inkling kit, I should say. Then I have a secondary Inkling kit with this Ice Wave tee that's going to be, uh, nin it's Ninja Squid with uh, three subs of swim speed. I don't know, this, uh, the Anarchy Elev Evolution tee looks really cute on, uh, on Little Miss Octoling here. Who needs a name, by the way? Uh, we're gonna, we're gonna try this, actually, we're gonna, we're gonna finish out the no Armor first, and then we're gonna try out that, uh, Respawn Punisher. I don't know that it's gonna be the best thing for me, because I tend to die a lot. Uh, we're gonna keep on keeping on with the Octo Shot, I think. Uh, we're gonna, we're gonna grind out, uh, at least the rest of this drink. Yeah, I got time. Why are Octolinks so thick? Did you just lo- This is no ordinary loss. That's a double loss. Nested losses. Cool. And good. We're gonna at least finish out the Neo Octoling uh, armor. Or not the, the Null Suit. Did someone ever actually wear the Null Suit? In the octo, oh man, I got ban hammered. We got a whole minute. You know what I'm gonna do with that whole minute? I'm gonna put up the BRB, I'm gonna mute my mic, and we're gonna be right back. I'm gonna grab some water because I am several thirsts. So, uh, play nice while I'm out. Don't anger the don't anger your robot. Well, robot mother i suppose does nightbot have a gender i don't know don't anger your robot overlord
So it turns out I was talking for the last, like, 30 seconds, and uh, the mic wasn't on because I'm good at pressing buttons. <laughs> uh, welcome back, uh, Land Fusion. Glad to see you here. Uh, let's get back to Sploon, you know? That's what we're here for. Join a regular battle. I really need to fix my um, my alert list because I don't think it works properly right now. Uh, let me go... Do I have my alert list even in this scene? I don't have my alert list in this scene. Oh, dang it. I should have owned... I should have joined um, Art Shadow. Sorry about that. I spaced on that. I'll uh, join you. I'll either join you or have you join me within the next match. Oh man, but I only got like 30 minutes left to stream with. Oh man. But hey, I, I got um I got plenty of stuff to edit tonight for two hours. You know, I got um I got a strong bad stream to throw together. I have uh Um I have uh, a couple Mondays worth of episodes to throw together. Did everyone just have the exact same idea? Like, we started walking forward, and then we all turned around and went, Well, nobody's getting the backcourt. <laughs> that was hilarious. Like, incredible team coordination. Oh, that's why this guy splatted me, because 96 gal. I was like, why did this guy splat me so quickly? Oh, cool, inkjet. Haha, -ha, I have one of those too! Oh no, the Tena missiles. Perfect. Whoa, does she say booyah at the end of the uh, at the end of a special? That's so cute! Also, I just absolutely walked my teammate into a super jump trap there, sorry. Oh, the Octo Brush. Man, I got I have such mixed feelings on brushes, man. Like cuz functionally, like I'm a big fan of the brush because like it's the it's the uh it's the it's the roller's more energetic cousin. But also like there's such a pain to play against. That was a massacre. <laughs> I just watched like half of the screen die at once. What's up? I see you. I also see your buddy up here on the grate killing people. Don't do that. Rude. You wanna play the you wanna play the inkjet game? Let's play the inkjet game. Play how long does it take this ink brush to kill me? <laughs> this ink brush is off to my right, I can feel it. He said while turning the camera, so that could be equally true for like 500 different versions of right. God, this 96 gal. They know what they're doing. The thing with the 96 gal is it's such a slow fire rate gun, but like in the first game when there was still, def uh, there was still, um, what's the word I'm looking for? There was, uh, power up. For weapons you could pump power up into a 96 gal and kill and kill people in one shot like literally one shot would kill them it was the most like it was super annoying like granted that was like 90 percent of your kit if you were pulling that but still i cannot believe i got that splat and i guess i can't believe it's butter either because we're gonna have some real close margarines <laughs> oh you splatted me for that pun. Rude. Oh no. My pun wasn't even valid. <laughs> we got, oh, I love your username, Glaceon. 500 out of 10. Ele bleh. 11 and 10 splats. Hello. All right, I'm going to drop out of this lobby and see if I can join Art Shadow again. If not, uh, you know, oh well. We're dry. We needed to drop out of the lobby anyway. Aha! Art Shadow is joinable. Please wait.
Hmm. Woody Boy Plays, hello, hello! Should your username be familiar to me is the question I'm asking myself right now, and I'm sorry if that's rude, I'm atrocious with names. I can't remember if you're a member of the Igloo already or not, but welcome, welcome, I'm glad to see you around. We got Shout Gamer in the chat as well, uh, that's always good to see. Sorry, Woody Boy, if you're a regular, it's been a long time uh, since I've been playing the game that has uh, this specific crowd around. <laughs> so, oh, I need to change the title to Gear Grinding. Um, title. Mm. Grinding up those chunks. But anyway, Woody Boy Plays, hello, hello. Uh, welcome to the Igloo if you haven't been welcomed before. If you have, sorry, my memory is... Oh, like a goldfish at best. <laughs> we got about two minutes to wait here. But uh, I should talk about uh, my YouTube and Twitch strategy as of late. Um, I've been posting the Wednesday... Uh, streams on Thursday a week with a week delay um, chopped up in bits uh, I just got twitch and you seem really nice oh bless you that's lovely of you to say I I try my best to be real nice that's very nice of you woody boy plays I'm glad to hear that you think I'm nice I I try to perform such that uh the chat's an inviting environment uh <clears throat> since you are in fact new around here i should mention uh wednesday nights uh we're doing variety games like this uh it's usually just whatever game i can pull off the shelf and make work after after work <laughs> uh unless i have something planned in advance um Friday nights is something called Paper Cuts, where I read aloud public domain books. So if you've got a book for for your you know English class you don't want to read, or uh, a book that's kind of old that you've been meaning to read anyway, I can read it to you. It's got to be before 1923. It's got to be in the public domain, unfortunately, for legal reasons, uh, copyright reasons. But feel free to you know uh, the best way to get a title to me is to uh email me it's glacier at gmail.com uh so you know keep that in mind if you're one to listen to audiobooks but it's not just an audiobook uh the the vod is just the audiobook um the the video after the fact that i post to youtube is just the audiobook but the stream uh you know i pause between chapters and i chitter chat for a little while with the chat and you know i <laughs> you know it's 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 an actual stream just the vod is just the audiobook because it performs better that way but speaking of vods uh <clears throat> the wednesday streams go up about uh with at minimum a week delay on thursdays on youtube uh Uh, yeah, on Thursday, uh, the week after, on a Thursday, at minimum, uh, the, usually the, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Usually the VODs, uh, that come up on Thursdays are chopped up into bits. I'm gonna start increasing the length of those bits now that I have a big long buffer of stream chunks, uh, out until August. I was just chopping them up into 20 minute episodes, uh, mostly for my own sake, uh, since I didn't want to run out of stuff because of my job, uh, you know, cause you know, you work a full-time job and then you only have so much time in the day. So, uh, now that we've gotten out ahead of, uh, ahead of ourselves a little ways, um, I'm probably going to chop up the stream VODs into something more like 40 to 40 minutes to an hour chunks rather than just 20 minute episodes. Uh, that's mostly for ease of viewing for the viewer. You know, if you saw something in a stream 
and you wanted to uh, catch up, you know, you missed a bit because you had to leave, um, 20 minute bits just make it so you have to wait weeks and weeks and weeks for a, ooh, for a uh, stream VOD to come out so you can catch up. Uh, but uh, 40 to 60 minute bits I think is a little better because then you can, well, 40 minute bits would be the most ideal because then you, uh, you know, you, they're long enough that it's not you're having to wait like a million years to see the whole stream hi there you know you don't have to wait you don't have to wait like a billion years to see the whole stream but also you know they're they're long enough to be you know a pretty you know a sizable chunk of the stream they're 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 long enough to be you know not the stream is in a billion pieces but they're short enough to be uh, you know manageable being like oh man I missed this part of the stream so I need to tune into this chunk of the VOD kind of thing and that's kind of my that's kind of my th my thinking on the on the VODs they're really very much for the uh, for the twitch public um, in that they wow how did that charger shot not hit me um, they're very much for the twitch viewing public um, I mean, my YouTube audience definitely seems to enjoy them, but they're very much more so for the uh, for the Twitch viewing public uh, as a uh, sort of a catch-up sort of, sort of thing. Wow, I'm going to get splattered for this. Uh, oh, I was behind that. I didn't mean to do that, but that was a good play. Oh, that charger. But yeah. Oh, cool. Uh, we got the Afro... Uh, the afro-looking tentacles on that octoling. That's such a cool design, by the way. Oh, I don't have drop roller. I need to just super jump less. I was just now getting into the habit of super jumping because I had drop roller shoes on like five seconds ago. What's that jacket? That jacket's fresh as heck. Like, I don't know if the ability is fresh as heck, but that jacket's fresh as heck. I want to order that jacket off that off that uh, octoling inkling. I couldn't. I wasn't paying enough attention, but I want to. I want to order that jacket. That's a fresh jacket. That's one thing I forget I can do with uh, with this game is order. You can still order um, gear off people. That's a that's an option, you know. How am I not hitting this person? Oh, good trade, good trade. Uh, Woody boy, if you have a switch and you want to play with me, uh, just type exclamation point switch into the chat. That's my uh, friend code. I should really include that in the. Uh, Inst Ooh, I should include that in the title. Uh, I should just say, like, uh, viewer battles slash chunk grinding, exclamation point switch. Yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm going to change that right right after, in, in a second. Literal a second. Yeah. Title. Chunk grinding slash viewer battles. Exclamation point switch. All right, that was a, that was a good that was a good match. I should just really include anytime I'm playing anything on the switch, just exclamation point switch. Unfortunately, uh, Woody Boy, you've kind of caught me at the tail end of the stream here. I wish I I wish, but I don't have money for that. But I really want one. Eventually, you know, you can get your hands on one. It'll come down in price, as hardware does. And it's definitely worth the buy, man. There's a metric ton of beautiful, game, beautiful, wonderful first-party games alone. And don't even get me started on the uh, on the indies, man. There's some great indie stuff out out on here. Heck, there's some just great thirty third parties that aren't necessarily indie. There's a lot of good stuff on the Switch because it's like the it's like the Nintendo console that the Wii U should have been. It's cause, cause people are really, you know, jumping on that bandwagon for it, and it's fair, man. It's, it's got a, it's already got a huge. By the time it reaches the end of its life cycle, it's gonna have a colossal install base. I should really like st just stretch my hands during, uh, during, uh, during these weights. Ooh, I wonder if I can incorporate the. Uh, hand stretch diagram into the um, into the layout. Ooh, if I took off the on-screen chat, I could do that. Uh, I don't know. I like having the on-screen chat, though. I think we might have DC'd. That's what this waiting for players with a full screen means, usually. 
It's unfortunate that I know that. But yeah, uh, if you have a Wii U, uh, I have a Wii U friend code lying around here somewhere. There's no command for it yet. I'll get to it eventually. Uh, but I would love to play something on the Wii U with some viewers. That'd be a good time. Hey, uh, hey, Arch. Oh, yeah, there it is. I was like, I'm, I, I knew we had a communication error. I felt it in my butt. All right, we, we can't, we don't, we don't have anybody to join, unfortunately. So we'll just, uh, hop in the regular battle here. Actually, before we do that, um, as much as I'm in, nah, I'll keep up with the Octo Shop for a little while longer. I don't know. I got, I got about 15 minutes before I uh, can. Before I have to head off to sleep, uh, so we got time for two matches, two matches, maybe three more. Uh, yeah, because these are like four minute matches. I got time for two, two, three matches more. Yeah, let's let's say three matches and then I got to be done because I got to sleep because I have Jorb. But uh, unfortunately, you caught me at the end of the stream, sort of, Woody Boy. But uh, usually around 6 p.m. Central Time, Wednesday nights. Um, Usually around uh, 7 p.m. Central Time, uh, Friday nights for paper cuts. Oh, and I, uh, I'm i in a Dungeons & Dragons group on Tuesday nights on a different channel. Uh, I'll usually be hosting it, so you can just come here on Tuesday evenings uh, for that. But, you know, feel free to drop into the, uh, the guy who hosts it. I can't remember his username right now because I'm zoned in right now. But, uh, good guy. And, uh, you know, I'll be host. I, I make sure to have my auto hosts uh, pick them up whenever we're playing Dungeons and or Dungeons and or Dargons. So, you know, if you want to watch me play Dungeons and Dragons, uh, I actually do play a Dragonborn. So, you know, there is dragons involved. Um, I know Dungeons and Dragons has kind of be become the come into the vogue, as the kids say. Uh, and that makes me smile. I mean, yeah, I really only... I, I, I hopped on the bandwagon with dice camera action, but, uh, I don't know, like, functionally Dungeons & Dragons as a role-playing game, you know, since Dungeons & Dragons is essentially the granddaddy to every RPG ever, you know, a lot of things lift the mechanics of uh, Dungeons & Dragons. Uh, so, oh, I shouldn't have done that. There's a charger. Well, uh... Did y'all see that splat? Did y'all see that splat that I didn't even know I was gonna get? Cause that was a good splat. <laughs> I was like, oh man, I'm gonna use ink armor and, and charge this charge this charger. And then I realized I didn't have ink armor and I thought I was gonna die. <laughs> and then I got a splat I didn't even know about. Alright, this oh this slosher. No but no oh man, he had ink armor. Good push. GG. Good play. Uh, we're not going to head that way again. That lane's pretty turfed right now. Oh, that, that slosher is a very insistent young man. I'm saying young man because they're playing a male inkling. So, you know, assumptions and all that. Oh, hello. Oh, man. Oh, I didn't have ink armor. My special isn't ink armor, you goober. So I would not have been I would not have been fine there. Oh, by the way that person was moving, there is somebody co either covering this area or they thought somebody was going to be covering this area. So we're we're about to get interesting. Uh, we're heading in center. Uh, down the down the left lane here. Although I guess the lanes lane uh, descriptor is kind of arbitrary because it's you know the map's mirrored. That was a good that was a good little miniature push. It's not going to get us much with 15 seconds left in the match, especially since somebody just popped ink armor and a bobbler. Oh, man. So this wasn't the most uh, winningest match, as the kids say, but good match. GG's. Good play on both sides. Oh, yeah. We got uh, dunked on. 37 and a half to... Or 37.2 to 51.1. That's atrocious. That's yikes. Were we missing a... We were not missing a player. That roller just wasn't getting the ink out. Feel bad for, for that person, I should say. 
Ugh, bomb defense. Grody. Sorry, I don't use uh, bomb defense ever in any of my builds intentionally. So, you know, it's unfortunate whenever I get it. We got uh, we got Art Shadow here in the in the game. I don't know if Art Shadow's still in the chat. You haven't been saying a lot, but if you're playing the game, you know that's how it goes. I get it, man. Like, whenever I'm in a community stream and I'm like playing, you know, matches with a streamer, I'm not saying anything in chat. I know, I know the vibe. Oh golly, uh, well have have yourself. A good sleep, Woody boy. I I hope that uh, you you arise well rested and uh, have a, have a, have a, have a good sleep. <laughs> and uh, I hope to see you around. Okay, Art Shadow is here. Good. I just assumed you weren't saying. All, I I assumed you were in here and just not saying a whole lot because you know game. that doesn't happen yet that's a couple it's it's a, it's like a good like half a motif away like the yeah that's that's a ways away now jeez okay oh yeah the jump the ink this does act, in fact have the jump function that you get it that has with it was that an octoling woomy that's adorable I'm sorry. I'm I'm a, I'm a big sucker for all of the uh, inkling sounds and octoling noises. Just the noises that the player characters make in this game are just adorable, and I love them. wasn't this Wasn't this a Splatfest color in the first game? The orange and purple. I I I have a distinct memory. Granted, like I played in every Splatfest but one. Oh, look at there. They just walked right into that. That's unfortunate. I'm gonna get splatted by this roller. Yeah, that. Oh, that roller is AFK. We're good. Okay, I need to back up. I need to back up right now. Uh oh. I really need to back up now. <laughs> Bye now. Leaving. Oh, dang it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, question of the day. Is that an odd spelling of Isaac or is that meant to mean something backwards? Because it could it it looks like both to my eyes. No! Don't do me like this. Don't do me up like this, Sploon. There was a minute left in this match. I I only have enough time for one match more. Mmm. Rude. Now this match doesn't count. Salty. Unfortunately, when the uh, when the uh, when the match d uh, drops, so too doth the stream go. So uh, we the stream actually appeared to blink out for a little bit there, but we're we've only dropped a point four uh percent of the frames for the over the whole stream lifetime so that looks like it's only happened uh twice over the stream uh in line with our disconnects so it's not too bad uh most nights i'm spending a lot of time waiting out disconnect ban hammers it's really unfortunate do tell me how that uh match goes art shadow because i'm interested uh, I got time for this match and nothing more, and I didn't think to join back up with you. But tell me how that match went. Uh, tell me if that if that DC was you know destructive or anything. Uh, dreadfully sorry about it, but my internet's not the bestiest. You know, I love this music. I just Splatoon and Splatoon 2 have the best soundtracks. Um. Like, just something about it, man. It's just chock full of bops. There is a someone under me. Oh, man. Your side won. Uh, you were on the other team from me, right? Ah, well, can't win them all. 
I don't know. I know I dro I know I dropped about with about a minute left uh, in the match. Oh, that charger should have killed me. Hey, that's a squiffer. There's no way any ordinary charger would be shooting that fast. <laughs> of course, I'm not the charger expert. Wow, that that took a surprisingly large chunk of my health bar. <laughs> I see you. Oh, that that stingray, that stingray very much should have killed me. Uh oh, oh man. Oh, bamboozler. Okay, I was like that. It was too fast for a normal charger, but I was I'm never I, I've never been one of much of a charger connoisseur, so to speak. That bamboozler though, man, it's it's wicked fast. That's cool. I don't know, the the bamboozer is actually fast enough, like just bap 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 that I might Oh Are you for real? I just dropped again. I might have to just be done for the night at this point this is what I really you know I really wish that Splatoon could tell when it's a you know DC thanks to internet speeds just random internet throttling speeds basically and uh, and then like a, phys a physical disconnect because like there should be you know a physical difference or a software difference in you know turning off the power to your switch and uh all right that's unfortunately uh that's about all i have time for if i were to do another match i would be i would have two minutes to close the close my computer and go to sleep so that's got to be it from me also got some art splatoon 2 despacito edition alexa play despacito um we got some fresh fresh art um what else we got here is this loss <laughs> i don't know why loss has become a meme again recently but it sure has it has made a visceral resurgence and it'll that, that'll have been the third time loss has returned to the meme sphere in uh, by my reckoning anyway welcome bridget don't know if that's uh someone that person knows or gutsy squid ooh ooh that's a little uh <laughs> that art's a little yikes what's this uh one more one more win and i'll rank up connection has been lost <laughs> mood why are octoline so thick uh booyah I think it's just octolings are adorable and so are inklings. That's really fresh art. I love some of the really just like high quality fresh art that's come out of this game. Chunk grinding, chunk grinding, chunk grinding. Vimo? Oh, since we went chunk, chunk grinding, I'm gonna scrub these and then I'm gonna go. Hey, what's up? Can I uh, scrub some slots? Let's see here. What did we fill tonight? Um, what did we fill tonight? We filled the, we filled the, the real life cans. Uh, not a lot of useful ability chunks out of that boy, unfortunately. Um, I don't know what I, I don't know what I want to put on the Octoling Shades, so I'll leave them unscrubbed. <gasps> unscrubbed for now. Is there anything else I need to scrub in my hats? The Anarchy Mask, um... I don't want to make my poor anarchy mask just not very useful by putting bomb defense on it, but that's the only use I have for bomb defense chunks. Um, this Takaroka visor I have a plan for. I need special charge up chunks for. Uh, these headphones I definitely want to put a sub recharge on. Uh, I'm honestly really tempted to scrub the 18k air aviators because I don't want to put cold blooded on them because it's just so. It's not very useful. I'm definitely going to scrub the MTB helmet, though, uh, right now, actually, because I am not going to use it in a set. It looks gross. So I'm just going to scrub it for the chunks. 
Um, let's say, let's see, the Hero headphones, uh, again, there's not any chunks I need on it right now, so I'm not going to scrub it. Studio Octophones, again, yeah, not uh, kind of the same case. There's, it's not like I need the chunks on it. The Skull Bandana, eh. You know, there's not a lot I can scrub hat-wise. Not, not a lot more. Uh, shirts. Um, I definitely don't want to sp scrub the Takaroka Wind Crusher. It could be a pure, honestly. I could just roll a pure if I'm really lucky. Uh, the Red Hula Punk. I don't think I had a plan. I have something, like, chunk planned for the... I have chunks planned for the Red Hula Punk, I think. Unless the hat has that. The hat I have planned for that one. Yeah, the hat I have planned... Um, uh, the jungle hat has ink resistance, so I think the, uh, the red hula punk with tie can actually get scrubbed. Uh, I'll use it as a chunk grinder. I think Anarchy gives me chunks I need anyway. I was just talking about how I don't have time, and then now I've run out the time. Uh, we don't have anything to scrub in the feetsies department, unfortunately. Uh, maybe the Null Boots replica. Yeah, let's scrub the Null Boots replica. Alright, uh, that's enough blowing of our money on ability chunks. Um, uh, let's see if we have any ability chunks to use, actually, while I'm talking about it. Uh, let's see. I have 17 special charge-up chunks, so not enough. Um, let's see what else we can do here. Uh, we need, on the Ice Wave T, uh, swim speed up, but we're a long way off from that. We need 29 more. Yeah, we need 29 more chunks on that. Uh, what else? I have, a, I have a different shirt that I wanted to use. This shirt, um, it's got a special charge up on it. Uh, we need a lot more special saver on this. Um, what else? What else? What else? Do you have anything else I can th throw chunks at? I don't think so. This juice parka, maybe. I don't know. The juice... Oh... Oh, the uh, octo-layered shirt. Um, I want to put a an uh, ink like walk resist on uh, the dark bomber jacket. Eventually, I'm gonna get another cold blooded on there. Um, yeah, there's not a lot I can blow chunks at with the shirts. I know phrasing. Um, the white Noramakis. I need a lot more swim speed for. Um, the black Noramakis are already done. I don't know. There's not a lot I can spend my ability chunks on. Do I have a splat net order? I haven't ordered anything. Okay. All right. I need. I needed to be done five minutes ago, so we're not even gonna see. Um. Well, I'm gonna let this uh, see, seeing of the stage. Oh no, J.K. We're not gonna see the stages. I'm gonna <clears throat> see if I can find somebody to raid, and that's gonna be the evening. Uh, looks like PBG is playing something. Um. Who else? Uh, Game Sun Quick is playing Mario 3D Land right now. Yeah, Mario 3D Land. Uh, Kara's playing uh, Sim Seasons. Oh man, we're we're hosting, we're raiding GDQ, man. Games Done Quick is a great, great cause. Raid Games Done Quick. If you're not big on speed runs, uh, I'd I'd say stick around anyway. It's for charity, man. It's for Doctors Without Borders. Uh, unfortunately, their uh, chat's sub-only, sub because the chat's been known to get pretty gross when it's not sub-only, but hey man, throw a Prime sub over there. It's a good idea. Since you can't spend it on me yet, might as well spend it on charity. Anyway, we're going to go raid games done quick. Uh, that's that's it, that's all for this evening, folks. I'm glad that you all showed up. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, tune in Friday for Paper Cuts, if that, uh, but if that's not your vibe... Tune in uh, Tuesday for Dungeons and & Dragons. And if that's not your vibe, tune in uh, Wednesday for a variety game. I don't know quite what yet. Might be some more of this. Might be something else. We'll see. But anyway, guys, that's it. That's all. See ya.